Well, it is back to class for thousands of students across our area this morning, and we are wishing a very happy first day to Cleveland County Schools as well as Gaston and Lincoln County. A reminder to give yourself some extra time on your morning commute since buses will be out picking up students in those areas over the next few hours. As we mentioned, Gaston County is just one of the districts heading back today, and that's where we find WCNC Charlotte's Richard Devane live for us this morning. Good morning, Richard. Good morning. Good Wednesday morning, everyone. And I've got the superintendent of the Gaston County Schools right here, Morgan Wuchard. Wuchard, yes, Wuchard. sir. Wuchard, Wuchard, he says. Uh, he's been with the district for some eight years. We took over in February of this year. So this is his first full year as superintendent. Excited about today? I am very excited. I tell you, sir, we have a faculty and staff that have been here for two weeks preparing for this day. When you walk the buildings, I get to talk to teachers and talk to students. There is a level of excitement that the first day brings every year. And a lot of the questions that the teachers will have every year is uh, teachers, do we have enough staff as far as teachers, as far as CAF, as far as uh, bus drivers? Yes, sir. We, we are not completely staffed, but we have uh, worked in a central office folks and we are filling positions uh, each and every day. So every classroom is, is uh, has a certified teacher that oversees it and will be participating in the teaching and learning that going on in the classroom. And throughout the morning, we've been touting some of the new things that you guys have got in the district, some some exciting programs we've talked about all morning. Just how does it feel to be the leader of a district like this? It feels great. There is uh, a lot of energy in our district, a lot of new construction going on. And I tell you, since February, uh, since I was given the position, I've been surrounded by support with the community leaders, community parents, teachers, faculty and staff. It's just been a it's been a great experience so far since February. Well, we know you've got some other interviews to do with some other stations, and he's got a message for all the parents there will be buses out there on the roads more cars than normal uh, for the last few weeks so give yourself some extra time and watch out for those kitties and kitties come on out to school today we'll see you here well, that's the story right here at robinson elementary school we'll send it back to you